hi in the last video lesson we've added those notification on the top right corner so that uh, we can have success and fail message so in this video lesson what we are going to do we are going to add i mean the header navigation and the folder and also create the sign in form okay so without wasting time let's begin okay so first of all what i'm going to do i'm going to split the terminal and first of all i'm going to navigate on the on the back end okay and type uh, npn uh, start because i named the script start and also in the font okay npn start okay so uh, that's it we're gonna have our application warning on the back end and front end at the same time okay so now we have our application warning on both um, back end and front end so let's add i mean uh, the header and footer component okay let's go back okay so and now let's go in the front end folder in source src in component let's create i mean two component i mean i want the header js and i also want i mean file uh, footer dot js and uh, in header i'm gonna add uh, i mean uh, a functional component uh, r a f c e okay and the header let's add the h1 okay header okay let's save and also in footer r a f c e okay this is possible because i install i mean an extension okay in the beginning of this video okay and now let's type h1 okay footer okay like so and now i'm gonna call this these two components i mean in sign up okay let's go at the top and let's import import header okay header form um, i have to go i mean one step up i mean dot dot okay and now i have to find a component okay component and after that i have header and also i want to okay i have here i mean footer and also i want to have this here and okay and i have header i'm gonna take this component i mean here okay i'm gonna add i'm gonna add i mean the header component and also i want the footer okay before the, the, clo the closing tag i want the footer okay and let's see and uh, now uh, let's give a try okay i'm gonna go in sign up component okay sign up okay as you can see i have header and footer but i have html ready for the header and the footer so that i will paste header and footer okay so let's do that okay now um back to our code editor i'm gonna replace this h1 tag with our custom nav okay and now i'm gonna do some indentation okay like so let's see where is the nav okay okay i think that's it and uh, if we save let's take a look in the front end of our application okay you see and now okay this is the appearance of the menu i mean uh, navigation and now let's go back okay and i'm gonna we are not going to use i mean this a tag instead i'm gonna use the link okay import okay link okay from and react water dom okay so uh, i'm gonna copy this link and uh, 
I'm gonna select all the A tag. Okay. Okay. So replace with link. Okay. And uh, now uh, I have to say, let's say this will be home, and this will be sign sign up, and this last one will be sign sign in and uh, what else okay i should say where to go okay to equal this one will be the home home page and if i copy this one this will be um the sign up component and copy all of these and this one will be okay the sign in component like so and now let's go back to our code editor so to see if everything is working properly and i have here sign up and here we go to the home page but i don't have i don't add yet i mean uh, the navigation for the home page okay and this is the sign in okay so great so as you can see everything is working great so uh, i'm gonna also add i mean this footer okay uh, let's go back to our code editor okay in the footer file okay this one i have the html already i'm gonna paste everything here okay some indentation like so okay so let's save okay and now let's go to the appearance of our app okay as you can see guys i have the navigation ready and i have the footer so what else i'm going to do i'm going to add uh, the sign in form this one will be more easy okay so let's do this okay let's add i mean the sign in component what i'm gonna do just to save some time i'm gonna copy everything from the sign up and here in sign in and paste everything so here i have uh, i have uh, i mean sign in okay copy this at the bottom i have also sign in and let's see what what else this will be sign in okay and also in the sign in Gonna get rid of name okay because i will only need email and password okay remove some some space and here i will add um, login okay what else i should remove and this i mean endpoint will be sign in okay um let's say okay so here also okay i will only need email and password okay this extra space remove it and i think it should be correct i'm gonna send only email and password in the post request okay email and password and uh, let's say okay now let's say um i'm gonna say if the response is success log in successfully okay and um, later i will create i mean uh, the dashboard component so if we want we can redirect the user to the dashboard okay but uh, i will go back to this component but now I think that's it so let's go in the front end of our, of our app to give a try okay okay so let's give a try and uh, here in the front end of our app so um, let's say um, job at gmail.com and uh, I mean first of all let's try to sign in without given information email and password are required okay let's say job okay so 
uh, it's because I have the same message, but we could separate in the back end of our application because this is coming from the back end. And um, let's add our own password. Okay. So as you can see, invalid credentials. Okay. So let's add a real one. Okay. And as you can see, login successfully. Okay. And uh, if you check to the console, okay, let's inspect because I have console log my application. And this is an object. As you can see, we have success true and it generates the token. Okay. And also, if we go in, um, I mean, our code editor, as you can see, this is generated by, I mean, uh, let me show you by Morgan, okay, the, the, the Morgan package, okay, and you see uh, the request made on API sign in, okay, guys, so um, that's it. So in this lesson, we have added, uh, I mean, uh, header and footer and also made the sign in with the toast notification guys so if you like this video please leave the thumbs up so if you have question please drop um your question in the comment section and uh, the more you like this video the more you help uh, with the youtube algorithm okay so that youtube suggests this video to others okay so uh, also you can invite your friend to the channel so that we can grow together so thanks for watching and see you in the next video